The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, second canto, first chapter, text number three, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on November 6, 1973, in New Delhi, India. Translation The lifetime of such envious householders is passed at night either in sleeping or in sex indulgence and in the daytime either in making money or maintaining family members. Nidra Hyati Napchyam Babai Nachabhavaya Dibhacharthi Hayarajam Kutumma Bharaneva This is the description of the persons who are blind. Apasatamatmatattam. Yesterday we have discussed this verse. Apasatam means one who uh, does not see apasatha, pasati. Pasati means one who sees, and apasati, one who does not see, blind. So, there are two kinds of men within the world. Uh, pasati, apasati. <coughs> Simply having the eyes, one cannot see. Uh, this is not because our senses are imperfect. We, are, we see every day the sun just like a small disk. <coughs> but it is not a small disk. It is fourteen hundred thousand times bigger than this planet. Therefore, our sensual perception is not all. That is not perfect. We are deficient. We commit mistake. We are illusion. We cheat and our senses are perfect, imperfect. As such, there is no possibility of having perfect knowledge by a conditioned soul. That is not possible. We have to receive knowledge, therefore, from the Supreme Perfect. That is real knowledge. Just like we have got experience, then nobody knows that there is soul. Uh, nobody knows. But we have to receive the knowledge from the perfect person, Krishna. Krishna says there is soul. Dehinas means the Thadehi, Kumaru Jovanam, the Thadehantram. Or he, Asmin Dehe, in this body, there is the proprietor of the body, the soul. But if we want to see, some rascal says, show me where is soul. He cannot see because he has no eyes to see. This modern materialistic person, they want to see everything, but he does not understand that his seeing power is very limited. Uh, if, if the light is off immediately, he cannot see. So what is the value of your eyes? Why you are so much proud to see everything? Can you show me God? Can you show me the soul? If you cannot see. You have no eyes to see. Uh, and what you cannot see, you can hear. Just like a blind man is sitting, he cannot see. Somebody comes. Uh, he inquires, who has come here? Now, if somebody says, it is such and such person, by hearing only, he can understand, oh, such and such person has come. Uh, so, seeing is not extremely uh, perfect experience. There are other senses. Uh, so, which is beyond the sense perception. You have to hear. Therefore, Vedic knowledge is called Sruti. You have to hear. Uh, not by seeing. Uh, simply by hearing. Sarvanam. Sarvanam kīrtanam viṣṇu smaranam pāda-sīvanam archanam bandhanam dāsam sakkhamātmam vedanam. 
if you want to know uh, the Supreme, then you have to hear from Him. Uh, just like about Krishna, we have to hear from Him. Krishna is speaking Bhagavad Gita. Krishna is speaking everything, all Vedic knowledge is Krishna. Krishna is speaking. The, how Krishna is speaking, that is as, as mentioned in the Srimad Bhagavatam, Tene Brahma Dida Adikavai. Krishna spoke to Brahma. Adikavi means Brahma. He spoke to him. But if somebody says, Brahma, when Brahma was born from the lotus flower, there was nobody there. So how he could hear from anybody? Huh? Therefore, Bhagavad says, Tene Brahma Rida. Rida means through the heart. Through the heart. He was educated. Uh, therefore, Krishna's another name is Chaitya Guru. Chaitya Guru means the Guru who is sitting within your heart. Chaitya Guru. But he does not speak to anyone. He speaks to everyone. But only the devotee can hear. That is stated in the Bhagavad Gita. Tesam satata yuktanam bhajatanga priti purvakam dadami buddhi yuga mutam jino mamupriyantiti. Unless you are a devotee, unless you are constantly engaged in the transcendental loving service of the Lord, He will not speak to you. He speaks, but you cannot hear. You have no ears to hear Him. That is not possible. Uh, Krishna is speaking, just Krishna is speaking in the Bhagavad Gita. Sarva dharman paritta jamami kang saranam daja. It is open speaking, but who is hearing? Nobody is hearing. Huh? Nobody is hearing. They have got their own conception of life. They, therefore, unless there is mercy of Krishna, there is no possibility of understanding Krishna. Atasya Krishna namadi navhavin graiham indriyai. By your this blunt material senses, you cannot understand what is the name of Krishna. Namadi. That's all I mean. Atasya Krishna namadi. That's all I Why you are bothering me? Atasya Krishna namadi navhavin graiham indriyai. In this blunt material senses, you cannot understand what is this Hare Krishna mantra. It requires purification of the senses when you will understand what is Krishna's name, Namadi, what is Krishna's form, what is Krishna's quality, what is Krishna's entourage, what is Krishna's pastime. You cannot understand. Uh, how you will be understand, understanding? When you are engaged in the loving service of the law, beginning with your tongue, Sevan Mukhihi Jivadu, by chanting this Hare Krishna mantra and taking prasadam. In this way, gradually, when you will be purified, you will understand what is Krishna. He will reveal, Krishna reveals. Naham Prakasa Sarvasya Jogumaya Samabrita. For others, he is covered with yoga mayas, carted. But for the devotees, he is open. This is the secret. Vedesu dullava adur lavato bhakto. If you simply study Vedas, you will never be able to understand Krishna. Uh, therefore, so many so called Vedantis, they do not know what is Krishna. They consider Krishna as ordinary human being. Abhijananti mana mūrha, mana simtanu āsita. So the mūrha, the rascals, they cannot understand Krishna. Uh, only the devotees. Bhatyāvāma vijānāti jābāñjas chāni tattata. If you want to understand Krishna uh, in truth, then you will have to accept this process, bhakti. Krishna never says that by jñāna, by yoga, by karma, you can understand. No. Bhaktya Mama Vijanati. Javan Jaschami Tattva. Tatovan Tattva Gatya Bhishati Tad Anantaram. 
दिस थिंग सर शो वी गृह में दिस एज आई हेव डिस्क्राइब लास्ट टाइम दे आर नॉट इंटरेस्टेड गृह में दिस अपश्यता मात्र तत्व गृहेशु गृह में दिन गृहेशु गृह में दिन दो आर सिंपली अ टैस्ट to this bodily conception of life they are unable to see the truth of satamatma tattva they cannot see uh, their only business is that is described here nidraya hyate natyam yes come in that their business is this apo apasata matpa tattam those who are blind those who cannot see the atma tattam what i am uh, such persons their what is their business occupation that is the distinction between uh, devotee and non devotee uh, in non devotee he is very much happy by sleeping uh, we have seen it practically in western countries you know very well if they can sleep 24 hours 5 hours in instead of 24 hours they are very happy uh, they think that they are getting some profit not only in western countries uh, i have seen uh, long long uh, about 50 years ago in calcutta the office peons they took letters uh, for distributing to other men but what do they do they, they will sleep at delaus square with the peon book <laughs> i have seen uh, they thought that this sleeping is our gain uh, we are getting a salary that is another gain but because without working and sleeping now for 3 hours in delaus square it is as another gain so this is the conception of the uh <coughs> 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 disturb kare uh, uh, isko kai le aaya ye to samjhega nahi kuch <coughs> so sleeping is also pleasure uh, but for the devotees for advanced devotees just like goshami is in bindavan सिरूप सनातन भट्ट रघुना दे कॉन्कर्ड ओवर स्लीपिंग निद्राहार बिहार का दो विजित हो विजित हो दे कॉन्कर्ड ओवर स्लीपिंग दैट इज रिक्वायर जस्ट लाइक अर्जुन इज एट इज गुरा केश ही कॉन्कर्ड ओवर स्लीपिंग टू कॉन्कर्ड ओवर स्लीपिंग इज द सक्सेस ऑफ लाइफ नॉट टू बी सार्वेंट ऑफ स्लीपिंग that is not required that is for the condition soul nidraya hyate natam for condition soul uh, therefore we have to practice uh, nidra aro viharaka adi vijito uh, sri 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 gaurang gunano vat uh, uh, gunano bannane uh, sadhyanito निद्राहार बिहार कादि विजित चातंत दीन चजो दिस इज द डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ द गोस्वामी रूप गोस्वामी यूज टू स्ली जनरली वन एंड हाफ आवर ओनली एंड दैट इज ऑल्सो समटाइम्स नॉट स्लीपिंग दैट इज द डिस्क्रिप्शन इन द चैतन्य चैता सो टू इंक्रीज स्लीपिंग इज नो क्वालिफिकेशन टू डिक्रीज स्लीपिंग आहार निद्रा भय मैथुन चमान्न में तत् पशु भी नाना ईटिंग स्लीपिंग सेक्स लाइफ एंड डिफेंडिंग दिस बिजनेस इज मेन्ट फॉर द एनिमल्स सो वी हैव गॉट द एनिमल पोर्शन ऑफ आवर लाइफ बिकॉज वी आर एनिमल्स अनलेस वी कम टू दी कृष्ण कॉन्सियसनेस पॉइंट वी आर सिंपली एनिमल्स those who are working on the bodily concept of life whole day and night they are simply animals their business is to sleep as much as possible at night nidya hyate natam otherwise 
babae no chabaya baba baba means sex two business at night either sex indulgence or sleep this is atma tattvam pashyata apashyata those who are awakened to the atma tattva they will simply think how much time i have wasted that is abartha kalattam abartha a a devotee should be always alert whether he is wasting time or utilizing time that is devotee's business so uh, this nidra hyate natam or babaye na cha bhavaya this is wasting life wasting time it should be minimized as far as possible uh, uh, this is not required this is the bodily necessities of life uh, and we have to come to the spiritual platform we have to be engaged only in spiritual activities uh, but those who are not interested in self realization uh, there there must be some engagement there are two things krishna or maya just like darkness and light where there is krishna there is no darkness krishna surya sama maya andhaka uh, maya is just like darkness and krishna is just like sunlight so as soon as there is sunlight there is no darkness just like this is night what does it mean night when there is no sunlight sunlight is there in other part of this globe but here there is no sunlight therefore it is darkness similarly as soon as we are not krishna conscious there is maya immediate uh, either maya or krishna consciousness uh, if you are not in krishna consciousness then you should understand that you are in maya and if you are in krishna consciousness then there is no maya mami mujap prabaddante maya me tang tarantite these are the uh, open description anyone who is fully surrendered to krishna he has no maya uh, now this does not mean that we shall completely exclude sleeping that does not just like those samis they were liberated person but they are also sleeping uh, because we have got this body sleeping rest is necessary uh, but you can, we cannot neglect this body but not that uh, that we shall increase the necessities of life uh, increase the necessities of the body that is upo goshami has gim nirbande krishna sambande jukta vai ragam uh, we have to uh, uh, i would say mold our life in such a way what is that anasakta uh, sab vishaya jatharam upajanyat this is vishaya vishaya means this ahar nidra bhay maitra this is called vishaya vishaya uh, does not mean one is very rich man he is vishaya no anyone he may be very poor man if he is attached to this eating sleeping mating and defending only he is a vishaya Uh, the Lochandas Thakur says, "Vishaya chariya se roshe mojiya." Uh, one has to gradually give up, minimize this vishaya. Vishaya means ahar nidra bhaya mai. Uh, uh, so vishaya, so Rupa Goswami gives the instruction: "Anasakta sa vishayan, uh, anasakta, anasakta, no attachment, sleeping required." but not for attachment somebody is living for sleeping and somebody is sleeping just to give a rest to the body uh, similarly eating also eating is not private uh, you have to eat because you have got this body but not that simply for eating and living uh, this is called jukta vai rag uh, rupa goshami say, says anasakta sabhi don't be attached to the vishaya eating sleeping with that i have to eat so much uh, i have to satisfy my palate i have to eat uh, the, this thing in the restaurant no you eat simply just to keep your body fit uh, not extra utyaharo prayasascha prajalpo niyamagra don't eat more than it is required for maintaining your body similarly don't sleep more uh, and 
as much as you require for maintaining your don't have sex life more than it is required they are they are allowed just like krishna said that uh, uh sex life which is not against religious principle that is a uh, uh, uh sex life against religion what is the avaida stri sanga avaida uh, illicit sex life that is against religious principle otherwise to get married and to be get nice children krishna consciousness children according to shastra that sex life is not forbidden uh, krishna said uh, yo dharma virodhi kama aham which is not against religious principle that kama that kind of lust i am but not for other purposes in this we have to mold uh, our life if we actually interested to uh become free from this janma mrityu jara vyadi dukha dosha anudarsana if we actually want to get free from the repetition of birth death old age and disease that is the our real problem people do not understand that this is our real problem they are simply engaged uh, in uh, some temporary problem the real problem is uh then why i am dying in the bhagavad gita it is said na hannate hanmane sharire the soul does not die even after the destruction of this body uh, so why my body should be destroyed uh, this is real inquiry uh, why can i not get a permanent body which will never be destroyed yes you will get you will get takta deham punar janma naiti mamiti kaun ka question is you will get a permanent body Uh, after giving up this body, takta diham, punar janma naithi, you do not get again material body. Then why shall I go? Mama thi, you come to me. If you go back to home, back to Krishna, then as Krishna has got eternal body, never to be destroyed. Similarly, uh, Krishna has got eternal body. Uh, you don't think that Krishna has got a body like us, uh, just like Krishna. When he was inquired by our John, Krishna said that uh, this Bhagavad Gita philosophy, I spoke first of all to the Sun God that we have calculated it is about four uh, hundred millions of years ago. He said, "How does he remember?" Uh, that means he does not change his body. Uh, we we forget because just like uh, in our last. past birth uh, now i can i can remember not all but some of my incidences of my life i remember but i do not remember anything of my past life death means forgetting about the past uh, so uh, because i have changed my body i have forgot but a- anyone who does not change his body he does not forget uh, that is the proof that krishna Krishna's body is not ordinary body. Uh, anyone who thinks Krishna as one of us, uh, he is a mudra. Abhijananti mang mudra. Uh, Abhijananti mang mudra manusimtanu masita. Because he comes just like a human being, we consider that he is also a human being. Uh, so uh, it is a great science. Uh, uh, therefore, Purikhit Maharaj inquired about Krishna. and sukadev goswami is describing and he immediately said varyane sate prashna your question is very glorified uh, uh, jad lokahitam uh, it will be varyane uh, sate uh, prashna krito lokahitam ja varyane sate prashna krito lokahitam nip atobi sammato upamisan ha So to be at ease, you jump for all. Krishna, Krishna, and Krishna answer. So answer is so to be. So so to be at ease, we are hearing so many answers. Just now you go to the market. We are question and answer. There are so many questions, so many answers. But this Krishna question and Krishna answer. So to be at ease, you jump for all. For all means superior or transcendental. This is not. Uh, uh, material things, uh, 
Narayana para of bhaktiya. Anything about Narayana, that is not of this material world. That is of the spiritual world. Therefore, Krishna question and Krishna answers, they are not material things. Uh, therefore, if we always engage ourselves in Krishna question and Krishna answer, Savanam, Kirtanam, Vishnu, that way it is called Vishnu. Not that any other Savanam, Kirtanam, only Vishnu. Vishnu means uh, Vishnu Tattva, Ramadi Murti Sukalanyam Enatishthan. Vishnu Tattva means uh, Ramadi Murti. Uh, Ram, Nishinga, Baraha, Krishna, there are so many, they are described. They are Vishnu Tattva. Vishnu Tattva, Jiva Tattva, uh, Shakti Tattva, there are different Tattvas. So, Samanam Kirtanam, if you engage yourself in Samanam Kirtanam, that should be for Vishnu, not for any other, anyone else. Uh, Samanam Kirtanam Vishnu. Uh, smaranam, Smaranam, meditation, that is also Vishnu. Uh, the yogis, those who are actually yogis, they meditate upon the Vishnu Murti within the heart. Dhyanavasthita tadgate na manusa apasanti jam yogino. Yogi, they they their meditation, Vishnu. Uh, so uh, this Krishna Prashna, Krishna uh, question and Krishna answer, uh, this is Lokahitam. Uh, anyone hears uh, in another place Sri Bhagavad says, Sinnathana Sakatha Krishna Punna Savana Kirtam. Uh, about Krishna, if you hear and speak, it is automatically punna savana kīrtaṁ. Oh. As it is said, savanaṁ kīrtaṁ viṣṇu. So, this savanaṁ Krishna viṣṇu means punna, punna savana kīrtaṁ. If you, even if you do not understand anything, if you simply sit down silently and give oral reception to the sound vibration of Hare Krishna Mahāvantra, you become pure. Punna savana kīrtaṁ. Sinnathāṁ sakatā kṛṣṇa punna savana kīrta. Simply by hearing, you become pious. Uh, because we are all impious. Unless we are impious, we don't accept this material body. Uh, then, then maybe the difference of degrees. Uh, that does not mean. Anyone who has come to this material world is to be considered as impious. Uh, therefore, Krishna says, Ahantvasarva Papi Bhava Friends. Because all of us are now in this material body means there is papa. Otherwise, why there is? Just like in the prison house, anyone, uh, he may be Gandhi or he may be a small pickpocket. Anyone who is in the uh, prison house, it is to be considered that he is criminal. He is a criminal. In the eyes of the government, we may worship Gandhi, that's all right, or any political leader. But government thinks that he is a king. Uh, similarly, uh, we have to accept the government's decision. Uh, similarly, uh, Krishna's decision. Uh, Krishna's decision is that anyone who is in this material world, beginning from Brahma down to this small end, uh, some or other, they are criminal. Uh, Krishna bhuliya jivi bhogavan chakare pasiti maya tare japutya. Uh, the maya's business is to capture. Uh, just like criminal is arrested by the police. Similarly, maya is also uh, engaged for this purpose. Anyone who forgets Krishna, anyone who wants to enjoy uh, uh, enjoy like, imitate like Krishna. But Krishna is the supreme enjoyer. Bhoktaram, Jankutapasam, Sarvaloka, Mahasam, he is the enjoyer. But we are imitating. Uh, sometimes we say, I am Krishna, I am God. Oh. This is our disease. Uh, we want to imitate Krishna, we want to become Krishna, we want to enjoy like Krishna, this is going on. So, so long we have got this propensity, we are sinful. This is the substance. Therefore Krishna says, Ahantva sarva If you surrender unto me, because you have rebelled against me, 
rebelling against me, you have come to this material world to enjoy. So I have given you all chances. I have given you the chance to become Brahma, to become Indra, become Chandra, to become uh, 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 Nixon, to become Gandhi, to become Jala Nehru, to become ant, to become cat, to become dog. I have given you all chances. And you have enjoyed. But you are not satisfied. Now, if you have got sense, just surrender. Sarva dharma paritajya mami kam sararanga. Ahankva sarva pavi bhamo khushan masit. If you actually want real happiness, then you surrender to me, I will give you protection from this sinful reaction of life. So, those who are very grossly sinful, their business is, is sleeping. Nidra hyate naktam, to sleep at night or to indulge sex life. Bhavaya huh? Bhavaya huh? means sex life. So, Bhavaya na chava vaya. The vaya, vaya means duration of life. The more you indulge in sex life, your duration of life is reduced. That is the scientific method. Therefore, the yogis, they give up sex life. Uh, it is a very great science. Uh, the breathing, during sex life, there is more breathing. So the more you, you misuse your breathing, your duration of life is reduced. Uh, and if you can preserve this breathing, then you can increase your duration of life. Why people are dying and nowadays? Fifty years, sixty years, seventy years? No, one should live. But at least hundred years. Huh? But because they uh, unduly indulge in sex life, they die early. Uh, their duration of life is reduced. Uh, so these people, apasyatam atma tattam, those who are ignorant of the atma tattam, they indulge in nidra hyate inaktam babayanachva. This is their night's nice business. And day's business, what is the day's business? Jiva Charte Hayarajam. In the evening, daytime, where is money, where is money, where is money, where is money, where is money. Go here, go there, go there, go there. All right, take money, then have to utilize it. Kutumba, Bharani, Nava. Then go to the shop, purchase this thing for my wife, for my children, for this, for that. So, money earned and spent and night sleeping and mating, then where is your time for cultivating Krishna consciousness? This is the position. Uh, so, mm. therefore, people are in darkness. Uh, one should be very serious, serious to understand the teachings of Bhagavatam. Uh, then he will actually make profit and make his successful life. Nittanga Bhagavata Sevaya. These are Nitya Vijukta. Nitya Vijukta. This Krishna consciousness movement is meant for engaging the people twenty-four hours in Krishna consciousness. Twenty-four hours. Not that partial. Uh, Twenty-three hours and uh, sixty minutes I will uh, spoil myself in this nidra hivate inaktam and for fifteen minutes I make some Krishna consciousness. No, not like that. Uh, uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says, uh, kītaniya sadāhari Tinadapi Sunita in Otorupi Saisna, Amanina Manadena, Kitani Sada. Sada means twenty four hours. You should have to mold your life in such a way that twenty four hours you will be thinking.